Well, the government shutdown is driving thousands of U.S. Coast Guard members to apply for financial assistance with the American Legion. And Wish TV's Tim McNicholas reports from the Legion's national headquarters in downtown Indy. Nearly 42,000 Coast Guard personnel missed a paycheck earlier this month, and if the shutdown continues into February, it could happen again. The Legion is taking matters into their own hands, and they say you can help out too. I have your TFA application in front of me. Martin Luther King Jr. Day was supposed to be a day off, a holiday for American Legion workers. Um, requesting assistance for their minor children in need. Instead, employees volunteered to work. They are sorting through a record number of TFAs, or Temporary Financial Assistance applications. They're coming in by the thousands. Um, Megan Sweet is the Legion's TFA program manager. I mean, we get thank yous every day, all the time of, um, you know, help me put gas in my car because they're still having to go to work. It, their kids don't have groceries right now. Um, so it helps them a lot. The TFA program runs on donations, and for now, the Legion can only afford to pay the Coast Guard members who need it the most. They're focused on helping junior enlisted ranks with children at home. When they miss a paycheck, it's a big deal. Retired Coast Guard Vice Admiral Terry Cross says the typical third class petty officer earns a base pay of about $600 per week. And if they miss two paychecks, it, it, it could be a disaster for a family in terms of rent payments, mortgage payments, just putting food on the table. Cross is hoping Congress will pass a resolution to pay the Coast Guard during the shutdown. It is the only Armed Forces branch not getting paid. We could definitely use the donations. Sweet says during the shutdown, the Legion's given out more than $700,000 to Coast Guard members. Now the TFA program is running low on funds. We've been there. We had kids while we were in. And so it's, it's vets that are giving back to vets. So it feels good, but it is emotional. It's overwhelming. And if you would like to donate, you could do so online at legion.org slash donate. We'll also have that link on our website, wishtv.com. At the American Legion National Headquarters, I'm Tim McNicholas, Wish TV News 8.